August 24th, 2019. We all remember that date pretty well, don't we? It's the night where yours truly made his official Call All-Stars debut. It was an elimination eight-man tag match taking on the Heartless alongside Alex James, Walter Scott, VPOC of all people. Now, when I first accepted the challenge, it was simply a favor for Walter Scott himself. It was nothing more, nothing less. But then, Steel became the main attraction. Somewhere along the line, the big Steel became the talk of the town, now didn't he? That brought a lot of eyes towards Zaya Steel's way. Because at the end of the day, there were two people standing in the middle of the ring when it all was said and done. Two people left. And that was me and you, Kenyon Phoenix. It was the night where Zaya Steele's name is still made in infamy. Where the entire Call All-Star fan base was chanting for more Zaya. Steve. And I'll admit, it felt pretty damn good. But you, 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 you saw something more, Kenyon, and I'll give you that. I'll give you your due on that alone. You saw something that no one else saw quite yet. You saw that more ruthless, more devious, more sadistic side of the big steel that you always knew was there, but some people just hadn't gotten the chance to see it yet. So for that, Phoenix, I thank you. I thank you for bringing more attention to that side of me. You brought me into Heartless because you knew for a fact that it would be better for us to be on the same side than to be on opposing oppositions. And for that, you are a smart man. I will give you that. I will give you credit where credit is due. But let's get one thing straight here. You did not create anything. You did not make me what I am today. Everything that Zaya Steel is in virtual wrestling is because of the Big Steel. And Kenyon, I know in that egotistical mind of yours that you like to think that Heartless was a failure because of the people you surrounded yourself with. No, 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 the reason the Heartless was such a failure is because you lost your way, Kenyon. You lost sight of what it meant to truly be Heartless. Somewhere along the way, you had lost that ruthless edge of yours. You became complacent in the Heartless. And that is when you and the stable itself died. And how you're coming out here making a challenge to me in a death match, no less. Kenyon. About ten months ago, I was involved in one of the most heinous Hell in a Cell matches I've ever competed in my life, but it taught me something. It taught me that what I've been doing isn't going to cut it anymore. What I've been doing for the past five years of my career isn't going to get me to where I was going to be. Therefore, changes need to be made. That is why I am the current CMC World Champion. That is why I am still going around winning titles wherever I go. This is why Zaya still continues to be the biggest marquee name out there because I am at a point in my career where I do not give a damn. I will set fire to anything and anyone that gets in my way, and that includes you, Phoenix. 
This is not a challenge you want, but it is a challenge you are going to get nonetheless because someone needs to teach you what it means to truly be heartless. You say I'm your greatest creation? <sighs> well, I guess, come call all stars 12, your greatest creation will also be your annihilation.